I feared as much. And why? Please, there has to be a reason. One that explains it all. What? By the name of the sun. I can't believe it. What? <laughs> what about the rest? Did you find any samples? If there is any chance I can free the Hazels from the shame my grandfather caused, I have to take it. I can cure the plague. I just know it. Only if they were being handled by a fool, which I am not. Mm -hmm. Please, I can imagine how this sounds to you, but I know what I am doing. Mm -hmm. If you don't give me the samples, there's no way I can atone. Thank you, thank you. This really means a lot to me. Here's your pay, and take this. You truly earned it. I'm in my laboratory now. There's much to do. Walk blessed, my friend. Nee, no. Kai sinä on oikeus niinku kokeilla yrittää parantaa se ruutto. Joo, tää ainakin tässä käydä kaupassa myymässä nää. Ruumut jos teille ei kelpaa. Ei sitä täällä ihan neljällä tyypillä oikeesti vallata. Move along. Kaupunkia. Another I turn a cunt. A cocky one, aren't you? <laughs> Fine, then let's do this the hard way. Yeah, huh. Yeah, I... I think so. 
That innkeeper, Daljan, told me he'd be safe if I didn't go too far from the cave entrance. Those bandits, they followed me. And... Mm -hmm. And I always thought this country was easier on our kind. You live and learn. But there is good news, too. Well, while I was waiting, I asked around a bit. Some of the sailors told me that there had been a strange group that had stopped in Doomville recently. Seven people, all dressed in gray robes. Yeah, and they caused quite the ruckus. Apparently one of them voluntarily gave the innkeeper a pouch full of gold for a handful of provisions. Sadly, the wrong kind of people got wind of it and tried to rob the group afterwards. Yeah, one of the group's women must have been a mage or something. Uh -huh. She the bandits apart with the flick of her finger. They stayed for one more day while they stocked up and prepared for an expedition. Then, the rich man gave all his money to the miners and they left. Apparently to the north. That seems likely, doesn't it? Exactly. All that happened two weeks ago. Do you understand? Terra was here. Just a fortnight ago. My thoughts exactly. Here, this is where we should find that ruin. It's a bit of a hike, but if we leave now, we should be there soon. Come on, you lead the way. Aika hyvä tää Grave Warden. No, Ismi lähti. Ja niitä tulee välissä.
robes. Like the ones in Dal Mercer's house. But why? Where are the cultists? And where's Terra? See, Tama. You can't know that. We we need to have a look around. Come on. Tää ei niinku näytä hirveen hyvältä. No se ei tytty. Se ei oikein... ...tykännyt siitä. Fear is a phantasm conjured by our own mind. You are afraid of a pain that won't come. She promised. Tara! Child. Mistress, we... You are afraid, are you not? Yes. What is it that you fear? I don't know. Death? You are afraid of dying. But that is not what will happen. None of you will. On the contrary. You will become part of something greater. Death is man's purpose. In the face of time, his life is but a flicker. No more than the batting of an eyelash. And his existence is pointless. Oh, Born to die in a world revolving around the same vices, the same mistakes, the same personalities. Trapped in an endless cycle. You, however, you are different. You are prepared to give your spark for something greater than yourself. You are on the verge of doing something meaningful. Something real. Meaningful to you. We are sacrificing ourselves so that you can live. You believe that I need your spark to exist, but you err. I do exist with or without you. And if you refuse, Tara, and this is how it shall be. You are not here because I forced your hand. You never were. Then I think you are here because, for once in your life, you want to do something with purpose. Something that matters. Your souls are too frail for peace, and stagnation poisons your mind. I am the watcher of the game. I have been for eons since the beginning of time, when from darkness came light. I do not judge. I do not feel. I merely preserve the underpinnings of your world. <laughs> then it will always continue like that. Eternal conflict. Eternal cycles. The prospect of this saddens you. You misunderstand. In every desert, there's a black grain of sand among a billion others. What do you mean? Every battle is a new chance. Nobody knows if man will ever overcome his nature. But one day he might. But until that day arrives, she needs to do what she does. Else this world would drown in chaos. And this is our purpose, Terra. Don't you see? To give her a part of our essence so that she can wander this world. You can go and be yet another meaningless drop of water in the stream of existence, or you can do something that matters. The choice is yours. Kyllä tarvin voimansa tolle, mutta jos toi ei oikeesti tarvin, niin. Blazes. This just isn't possible. They have to be somewhere. Gone. What do you mean? How do you know? What's that supposed to mean? Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. I... These visions. How certain are you that they're... accurate? 
No. No, I don't buy it. Terra wouldn't do something like this. Not for some group of deranged lunatics. Never. Something that mattered? This? God damn it. And what about us? What about all those years we spent together? Didn't they matter too? Why, Terra? Why, by the seven, wasn't that enough? Why couldn't you just be happy for once in your fucking life? I... I just don't get it. I don't get it. No, they didn't. She had it all. For fuck's sake. Do you have the slightest idea what some people are actually going through out there? Day in, day out, they have to fight for their survival. But her? She had it all. A roof over her head. Food, money, people to whom she meant the fucking world. But no, that wasn't enough. That was always about herself, even this. She never wasted a bloody minute even thinking about what it would do to me. Tara, Tara, Tara. It was always about you, and you alone. Something real. Bullshit. This was all about feeding her ego. The ever so sad looking Eterna girl with the watery eyes. Fuck the rest, right? Fuck what your stupid sadness does to the people around you. I... I need to go. This is too much. This is just too much. Santa jonkin verran. No joo, toi on aika kova juttu käsitellä. Okei, liikaa kikkala.
Manchuikka näillä on aika hyvät kidevät. Mikä tee on? Spear. Luultavasti tarvitaan oven avaamiseen tää. Ei se meillä vähän niinku palo hermot, niin... <laughs> Okei, okay, toi on vielä joku vampyyri, vampyyri tommonen. Miakka, yhdellä lyönnä. Vastustus sormus.
Sneak bone. Vielä parempi. Then you know her. Great, then you're the one she wanted me to find. She wouldn't give me a full name, but she asked me to give the woman fit in her description this. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to push on. Meet me at the old lighthouse near Duneville. Esme. Ah, I was wondering if you'd come. No idea. I discovered it by accident. But there's something about it, isn't there? It helps me clear my head. It helps me think. Good question. Shall we go up? The view from up on the roof is great. My, look at that. If it weren't for the Bone Rippers and the Bandits, this place would be almost picturesque, wouldn't it? Tara would have liked it. I'm sorry. My emotional outburst in that ruin, it was uncalled for. I shouldn't have said those things. Neither to you, nor to Tara. To her memory, that is. No. Selfish is the right word for it. You know, Tara once tried to explain to me what it's like to live that black fog. We had just spent a wonderful evening together, and we were sitting on a beach. We kissed and cuddled, and then all of a sudden, she started crying. I tried to comfort her, but it was pointless. She just cried and cried for almost an hour. At one point, she told me that she was sorry. She was sorry for being how she was. That there was nothing she wanted more than to be different. But that it was out of her control. The fog. It's always there. And there are moments when it just overwhelms you. No matter how hard you try to fight it. Don't you see? She didn't choose to be that way. And she told me that the worst part of it all was seeing how much her suffering dragged me down right along with her. Yes. I don't even understand what it is that you love about me. All I do is drag you down. <laughs> Strange, isn't it? Now that I'm telling you all this, I understand her. But back then, I just didn't. I couldn't. Good question. Of course, I still struggle understanding why she did it. And the fact that she's gone breaks my heart. It just breaks my heart. I wish I could travel back in time and tell her that I will stand by her, no matter how she is, and that she never was or could ever be a burden to me. Don't get me wrong. I don't blame myself for her decision. Joining this cult, giving her life, it was her choice, and she didn't do it out of malice. But I just wish could have somehow made her realize that it always gets better. That the two of us might have eventually beaten the fog someday. You don't need to say anything. Of course, there are still so many questions. Most of all, who that veiled woman really is, and what she needed those people for. But I'm guessing we won't get an answer to that. Who knows? Maybe what she said was right. And Tara's sacrifice really wasn't for nothing. We'll never know. Well, I'll see. I guess I'll travel back to Kyle, to my clan. If I find a ship that's still willing to cross the Red Sea, that is. Ah, and here. I promised to give you this, didn't I? Thank you. How about you, though? What are your plans? Pelastan, pelastan maailman. Why doesn't that surprise me? Well then, I'll stay here for a little longer. The sea, the moon, the night sky. I know it sounds dramatic, 
but they helped ease my mind. Tällä kaikilla, kaikilla <laughs> sivuhenkilöillä on ihan hirveet <laughs> mielenkiintoiset umpikierrot tarinat. With my talents? You mean never sticking to an agreement, uncontrollable emotional outbursts, and running away screaming at the sight of a pus bug? I'm not sure, but something tells me that this mission of yours needs someone with a different skill set. Keep your chin up. I'll see you around. Oli oli mielenkiintoinen arvotus, mutta nämä on niin kuin Tämä on aika, aika tota, noin, niin kuin, äh, ekstriin tasoisia nämä vastustajat tässä näin. Joutuu monta kertaa kokeilemaan, etenkin jos pelaa hardcorella niin kuin mä pelaan. Tätä kyllä ei ilmeisesti kannattaisi pelata hardcorella, vaan jollain vähän kevyemmällä vaikeusasteella. <tos> 